been playing around with my um, little waveform generator here and I've got it plugged into this stereo using the stereo as an amplifier and now I've run it into an ignition coil to raise up the voltage but I just noticed something interesting which I'll just uh, show you here if I take a normal um, 240 volt 15 watt globe and if I, this is just a coil and a transformer just a single winding um, I can just tip it over and if I just hold one end I can shoot the sparks and light up the filament Now, it only works when the spark is jumping. If I just connect it on, it does nothing. And if I don't hold one end in my hand, it doesn't work very well either. We get a little bit there. I'll just get a bit closer. So I just hold this in my hand, and then I can... As long as I shoot the sparks, the filament will glow. I can do it on the other end of the wire. Uh, oh, sorry. See, I have to have one end in my hand and the other end, this end here, I have to, um, it has to spark, it's got to be a spark gap. side there it works okay as long as I hold it but once it's connected you get nothing But with the spark, the filament glows. If I let it go, see if I don't hold it, as soon as I put my finger on there, So it's very interesting because it takes current to um, light up the filament there and if I can show you the filaments uh, you'll see they wobble about See the filaments. Oh, I've got to hold it. See the filaments sort of spread apart. Anyway, I 
thought it was interesting because the uh, current has to come from somewhere. As long as we get the spark right. through my body without a problem. <laughs>